Hello everyone. It's Sunday in November, the 14th I believe, today. Uh, it's been a very busy week. I'm sorry I didn't get the other videos up yet, but I'm going to try to upload all of these today, if weather permits me. Some of you might remember this is the view outside of Hillside's porch, or the ostensibly the bathroom door looking out in between Bakerbilly and Camp Earl. You'll notice that the trees behind Camp Earl, particularly the big birch that leans up against it, is gone. Obviously we had to do that in preparation for moving the cabins and making them safe. Um, I am sad to report that the trees were almost close to dying, so it was probably a good thing that we took them down when we did. Uh, they might have um, done a lot more damage than what we did to the trees in terms of the cabin. I'm standing up here ready to show you some of the progress that was done this week. As I pan to the right, looking over towards Sturdivant, you'll notice there's a piece of equipment. Uh, that's one of the hydraulic units that the building mover uses. And I'm going to pan over here to my right, and you'll notice Birch Bauer is sitting on a foundation, and there's nothing obstructing my way here, because Hillside is sitting in a parking lot. You'll see the crib work underneath it in the steel, and we can look directly underneath it. This is the old foundation to the fireplace, and this is the basing of the area that it used to sit in. That timber that's on the ground was one of the logs that they skidded it up on, and it served as a sill, um, and literally sat directly on the ground. This was a bit of a problem to pick up, not too much, did a nice job. You'll notice that the uh, chimney is gone, and there's some bricks sitting on the shed roof. Now this shed is going to uh, look a little different next year. The bathrooms will be in the same place, but they're going to have an addition in this building, and I'm going to not really divulge what it is yet, but I'm sure you'll be able to figure it out. But if you come up for Christmas, this cabin will be done, as will Birch Bauer. As you can see, Birch Bauer again is sitting on a foundation. I'm slowly going to take a walk around here, hopefully not too bumpy for you give you another perspective of some of the things that have occurred this week. This is a little bit longer video than they normally are. However, there are some of you out there who are enjoying the engineering feats that go on in doing this. I'm standing in the driveway now. Looking back out over the lake, you'll see Camp Earl on the other side of the machinery. Bakerbilly, and that's where, that's where uh, Hillside used to sit and is going to sit again next Wednesday. We will have a foundation in the ground. We're going to save the great big pine trees. We're going to do our best to save all of the foliage we can. Some of them had to go. They've meet, met their uh, life expectancy and beyond in some degrees. Fairly matured all of the trees here, um, which is sort of good and bad. Gives us an opportunity to plant for the future. Okay, a um, little bit of a view underneath the building. One more thing that we've done that I think most of you will enjoy, you see a new light pole. There's five of them now in the driveway. There's one on the other side of my truck. Uh, those will house some new lighting. Uh, we've dug all the sawdust out. We had to do a lot of work on the ice house this year, but that's for another video. Listen, I hope you're all doing well. I hope the world is treating you well and the economy is getting better for all of us. And Don't hesitate to make your reservations for next summer. I'm looking forward to uh, hearing some more comments. Uh, I had some wonderful comments this year on how to make things better for you, and hopefully I'll be able to implement all of your suggestions. I think you'll find that I'm diligent about meeting my customers' needs, and I hope you're enjoying these videos as much as I am having fun making them. I'll take care. Enjoy your Thanksgiving if I don't get back to you then. Peace to all of you. Bye-bye.